Friends, hello! This video, I want to tell you what to do with tomatoes when they have grown to the ceiling of the greenhouse. You can't leave it like that because in the morning or evening, condensation forms on the ceiling of the greenhouse, specifically on the film. The film becomes wet, the top touches the wet film, and the tomatoes can easily catch a disease. To prevent this from happening, you need to do the following. Take and trim the top above the last leaf, which is at a sufficient distance from the ceiling, approximately 10 centimeters. I will do the same here, but as you can see, I have clusters here, and to ensure they form properly, I need to leave a few leaves to nourish this cluster, so I will trim around here. But what will happen next? Firstly, the nutrients are now being redirected from the growth of the top to the delicate clusters and the ripening of the tomatoes. But in a few days, suckers will start to wake up in the internodes, even though you remove them, and they will begin to grow vigorously. Therefore, we monitor and remove them. This way, we prevent the plant from wasting its nutrients on the growth of side shoots and the top. Let the harvest start ripening. And this will happen quite quickly. And there's no need to worry that if we had left the top, some more harvest would have set and ripened very slightly higher up. No, that won't happen. Because here in Ukraine, in the Kharkiv region, a bush can form a maximum of six clusters. This is the last one. And since I'm growing in two stems, I end up with 11. On the side shoots left, there will be a total of five clusters. And those that grow higher will bloom and set a small crop. But they won't have time to ripen by the end of the year because there won't be enough time and nutrients for the tomatoes. But after trimming the top, the plant and the tomatoes will have everything they need. So make sure to do the same with your tomatoes if they have already reached the roof of the greenhouse. And if your greenhouse is very tall, leave six clusters on the bush and trim the higher ones by a few leaves. That will be enough. If the information from this video was useful, be sure to give it a like. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss new videos. I wish you a great day and see you in the next videos.